Bonjour, Saints. Today is Thursday, August 24th, and our musical notes are floating in from Paris, France. Mozart visited Paris when he was a child prodigy, and then later as a young man. While the city inspired him, it posed challenges. Yet his symphony number no. 31, also known as the Paris Symphony, was composed here. Teachers, can you point to the city of love on our map? And now it's time for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand up in your classrooms and place your right hand over your heart. Are you ready, saints? Let's begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And after school sports and activities, girls volleyball and blues soccer placements are today at 3.15 p.m. Good luck, saints. Check out the live cam of Louise. Teachers, feel free to tune in to the morning show at any point during the school day so you can see what Louise is up to. And now, please bow your head for the morning prayer. Heavenly Father, you are my salvation. You are the one who sustains me and gives me life. You are my strength and my defense. And I know you are always there protecting me and guiding me every step of the way. Thank you for the gift of this new day and when we use it to glorify you in everything we do. In Jesus' name, amen. That's all for Saints News this morning. It's now time to go over to Mr. Salvo, who is here in the studio with some special guests from second grade. Good morning, Mr. Salvo. Morning, Cole and Timmy. Thank you so much. Um, always appreciative of our eighth graders or our seventh graders sometimes who are anchors and also working the booth out there. So this is a, uh, a complicated job and our Mr. Murphy, um, just everyone who is involved in the production. So I'm here with Mila and Bailey, some more second grade visitors. We also have Mila's new this year to St. Mary's, and but seems very happy. She said this is her first time ever on TV, right? Yes. And Bailey said it's your, th I guess your third time on TV. Because mm -mm, pre-K was the COVID year. So kindergarten, first grade, second grade, right? Oh. Probably, right? So it's like, her, it's like her second or third time on TV and that she still, quote, doesn't love it. And I'm like, I can... I can understand. I still get nervous sometimes, too. All right, you guys said we'd start off with a, a quick question for so. So what is, Mila, this is get to know you especially, what is your favorite animal? A cheetah. A cheetah. Do you like the speed of the cheetah? Like how fast they are? I like, I like, I like how it looks and how fast it is. Yeah, I think cheetahs go close to like 70 miles per hour, right? 75. 75 miles per hour. That's as fast as cars on the highway. Well, speeding cars on the highway. Speed limit, I think, is a little lower than that. Bailey, what, what is your favorite animal? A llama. A llama. Have you ever seen a real-life llama? Like at the zoo or on a safari? You have not. I think they, I wonder if they have one at the Tampa Zoo. Let's go check that out. And then with the theme is music this year. Who's your favorite musical artist? Do you have, like, a favorite musician you listen to that makes you, gives you, puts you in a good mood? Do you like Taylor Swift? Okay, did you, did you like Taylor Swift, Mila? Yes. Okay, so we had a lot of Swifties, I know, in like second, third, and fourth grade. But um, I like Taylor Swift, too. There's a lot of artists. I like all kinds of music, including Mozart. Mozart's great, too. You guys have some facts. Well, Mila, you have facts and jokes. Okay, let's hear it. Um, there were nine types of tigers, sadly. Three are now extinct. They are extinct because of illegal hunting and loss of habitat. There were nine like, types of tigers. Three are extinct. Extinct means they, they no longer exist. And it sounds like, unfortunately, because of some hunting and habitat issues and so forth. Mm -hmm. That's a, do, you think they're, do you think the six that are left, are you happy with the stuff that's in place to protect them now? Not really. Not much people are hoping. More people are hoping them be die. All right, well, more people. We need to protect those. Those are called endangered species. We need to protect those, and there's a lot of those in the world. So do watch. I have do I have time for a joke? Yes, of course. Thank you for asking it so politely. Yes, I forgot you had a joke, too. Um, what does a tiger say when it meets another animal? What does a tiger say when it meets another animal? I don't know. Please to eat you. Please to eat you. Yes. Tigers, tigers are a pretty intimidating animal. They can do some damage. So, all right. Hopefully... We won't see him too many tigers around here. Bailey, what you got? You got a fact? All right, let's hear it. Did you know golden retrievers need lots of exercise and are very good at dog sports? Golden retrievers need lots of exercise. You know that Louise is a golden retriever, right? 
So she needs lots of exercise. So I know the kindergartners have been walking. Last night I got an email from a student who asked if they could help walk. Do, do you guys want to walk Louise sometime? Okay. She pulls a little bit. She's a little crazy right now and puppy, but you're right. She needs exercise. And she's pretty good at sports like fetching and swimming. We found out she likes to swim. She jumps into our pool. It's crazy. I know how it's like to have a dog. I used to have one. Yeah. yeah. But now she's in dog camp for three more years. She's in dog camp? She's going. They're really getting. That's some intense training. I know. <laughs> All right. Some, there's some times right now where I wish Louise would go to, like, three-year dog camp and just learn how to, you know, be potty trained and everything in the house. Like, she's making a mess at our house. So, okay. You guys, great job. Great job. We're going to see you in the morning show. There's other performances here. Mila, you feel great? You feel like you're part of the community already? Love it. Love it. Again, message. We got new friends everywhere. Come introduce yourself. Say hi. No one should ever be sitting by themselves at a lunch table. No one should ever be playing by themselves outside at recess. Be good friends. Take good care of yourself. Take good care of each other, which is clearly happening. Take good care of our school. Ready? We're going to do three, two, one, go Saints. Bailey, you look so serious. <laughs> okay. Three, two, one, go Saints. Have a great day, everybody. <laughs>